Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another edition of Cooking with Tank and today we're making a leftover crunch wrap. Meaning, whatever the hell I have, we're going to put in this crunch wrap and seal it in the old George Foreman grill here. Because I don't have a panini press or a press and I'm too lazy to put out a pan but I'm guessing motivated enough to bring out that big bastard. Who knows? So, let's see what we got. Well, we got some leftover chicken, shredded chicken, rice, and like tomato mixture. That will be like the meat. <laughs> uh, for like the sauce type stuff, we have some cheese whiz. We'll use that. And to make it a little bit more spicy, we'll use sriracha. We got a, some jalapenos. And of course, we need the wrap itself, so we got ourselves the a big boy tortilla here. And it looks like it's the final one, so that's good. We're going to have it in this. So, for the actually for the crunch, just grab some Cheetos. Let's get to this. <laughs> well, that tortilla is kind of in an awkward shape, but that's okay. We'll still make this work. So we're, so we're going to start off with the cheese whiz. Let me just grab a spoon. We're going to get a nice dollop like that right I would usually use a nacho cheese for this but uh, I'm kind of didn't think about getting some <laughs> so now we just mix around and around and around okay good so now, mm, we're going to squirt some sriracha on here. Just kind of rotate it. There we go. Set that aside. Now, We're going to take our chicken rice mixture. Kind of put that right in the center. How's it up? Mm -hmm. Don't mind that sound. That is the George Foreman turning on, or it's already on, but it's hot now. <laughs> and now we're going to add on top of that some shredded cheddar. Now we're going to put some Cheeto. Or should we just go like that? <laughs> All right. 
Now we're going to take a, it's just about the same size, but we're going to take this tortilla, but I'm going to take a pizza cutter. And then we'll do the cover deal. But first, before that, we're going to put a couple jalapenos on here. Fade warning when you're using jalapenos or any spicy pepper that you have, remember to uh, wash your hands thoroughly because when you burn your one, you don't burn your wiener once, you learn your lesson. <laughs> All right, now some more sriracha on top, just rotate it around. Now we're going to top it off with this piece. And now we're going to try to fold it because <laughs> it is a hefty boy. All right, somewhat folded, as good as we can possibly get it. All right, ta-da! <laughs> now, let's bring you over to the George Foreman, and we're going to be easy. Try not to burn yourself. There we go. And as that's happening, we're going to cut here and then come back and enjoy. <laughs> hoo, hoo, hoo. Yeah, that is good looking. So it's time for that cross section. Oh yeah. Look at that inside there. Nice little pocket poo. Mm. Down the hatch. It's, it's a loaded one, technically, because you get all that, that meat, um, rice, and all that good jazz. It just tastes delish. The crunch from the Cheeto, the spice from the Sriracha, and the jalapenos are good. And when I was cooking, some of those juices from those jalapenos got into everything, and it tastes really good. It is a good zip. The cheese was in the sriracha work great together. It's really good, you guys. It's that simple to uh, make some leftover, whatever you have in the fridge, um, crunch wrap. So go ahead and give it a try. 
So till next time, my friends and fans, I've been Tank signing off. Have a wonderful day, night, evening, whenever you're watching this. And always just remember. Make sure you have them certain friends in your life that will do anything for you, that will do absolutely anything for you, that, you know, you just, you need their help, like, working on something, you know, something, nothing, n nothing illegal, okay? <laughs> but we also can tell, have to tell those friends, like, no, I can't do that tonight. No, we can try it another time. You know what I mean? And then they won't get upset about it. They'll understand. That's things. Friendship is the key. Peace! And one eye. Later, guys.